dancing with a psychic. Does it blow your mind? How I read your mind. Your mind. Your level of excitement. Oh, baby, tell me how you like it. Two sets of prints led to a forested area down the slope. The rescue team found an improvised fireplace and two bodies. They were lying in but their underwear, with cuts and scratches to their limbs, suggesting they had tried to climb the tree in panic. What could terrify them so much? The next three a bodies bear. were found scattered a few hundred meters from the first it's discovery. One of them had suffered a fractured skull, it this despite no evidence of a struggle. It was a bear. It took the spring thaw it was two months bear. later to it enable the bear. rescue team to find the rest of the victims. The last four skiers were found buried in a thick layer of ice and snow. Because of a bear, it was a Their bear. Their autopsies led to even more bizarre findings. <laughs> All of the bodies had severe internal injuries caused because by an undetermined inside. force, similar to that of a serious <laughs> car accident. No it external was a bear. damage nor bruises were visible, besides a tongue ripped from one victim's mouth and a strange orange skin color. Much speculation day. arose from these puzzling events. Such theories included attack from the local tribesmen, from an avalanche, or animals. It was a bear. Each oh. theory, however, only there served to create more questions. The truth behind this tragic course of events remains unexplained to this day. What really happened? Maybe the answer still waits to be discovered, deep under the snow. It was a bear. <laughs> hey everyone, we playing Colot. Scary games in the snow, featuring the bear. Mm, Want to introduce yourself? No. <laughs> Do you? Hello, it is me, Mystery. If you know my name, I'll have to silence you. <laughs> this game looks really nice. You don't know what happened to the last people that found out my name? But let's just say that they thought it was a bear. <laughs> You watch the intro. <laughs> Ooh, new cave. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> yeah. Idiot. In the end, you fucking idiot. Our souls flash. You fucking idiot. I think this is their camp. What? Don't say stuff like that. <laughs> this is a scary game. You can't why say aren't that. They, why aren't they speaking Rochian? <laughs> it's for ease of access. Whatever. This game shouldn't even be played by people who speak English. The English narrator is exclusively for the Russians. <laughs> Russian people play this game and they're like, What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, that was a short act. Tried to hold on to your humanity. Was Homestuck always like this? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> you when they told you that you were a monster, you deserved punishment. You're talking about the bear. <laughs> You know, PT is kind of like slender because you walk around in it. See, I got the paper. I set out the moment I heard about the incident. I was in the area. So Are we gonna I listen to, to the unit myself to be? Oh, I don't think so. Make up your own meaning. Move on. Um, this asteroid. Now it's a meteorite. Came. Why are you? Oh. <laughs> Wait. Oh. What's that? Oh. What's happening? Ah. What's going on? Ooh. <laughs> he just stole your dick! He what? just stole your dick! He stole your dick! He stole- That's 
monster. Is the monster for the whole game? Yeah. Oh. I kind of wanted like a, a creepy inhuman horror. Oh, look, they're running away. Who's running away? There were ghosts of like the, uh, the people running away. I'm not a huge fan of this energy man, I'll tell you what. This is just like Resident Evil 7 where you walk around. John John Fire Ghost walks up to me and says, Welcome to the family, son, and then vibes. <laughs> <out. laughs> what if instead of punching you, he grabbed your nuts? <laughs> Welcome to the family, son. What have... state does that game take place in? Alabama? Yeah, that's what I thought. <laughs> <laughs> Mysterious lights. Those are street lights. It's a bear. The lights were a bear. Can you hear that though? Hear what? I heard wood creaking. I'm sorry, that's my wooden tea. Why are they creaking? Because I'm clenching. <laughs> gnash, gnash, gnash. <laughs> Who set this fire? Smokey the bear is not going to be happy, guys. What is he going to do? What is he going to do? Oh, wait. Yeah. The... Oh, yeah. shit. <laughs> yeah. Remember that one. So, bears aside. Right. What do you think would be the scariest thing you could encounter in the snowy Russian wilderness? Um. Uh. Something that if you if you are walking over a hill, um, just over the uh, decline, you can kind of see something peeking upwards. But when you travel to the top of the hill, it disappears. That's very specific. <laughs> Why can't you quick travel? I don't know. I don't know how. We get it. You're a furry. The scariest thing in the Russian wilderness is the furries. <laughs> that would be kind of scary. I think the scariest thing would be if, um, in the contours, in the contoured shadows of anything that you see, there's, um, the the vague shapes of of weird creatures that are man like uh -huh. or if you looked up into the sky and you saw something looking back down at you that yeah <laughs> that'll do it or if right behind you you could feel something lightly touching your shoulder or if in the distance in the distance you saw the outlines of many men but when you approached them they only looked like trees they changed shape transmogrified i thought you were gonna say that still lots of many men and you get there it's only one man a tiny blurry man a tiny blurry man well, you know what else would be kind of scary Is that... if you could fully see someone standing a ways off from you staring at you, not even trying to hide, and then every time you approached them or ran away, they appeared at the same distance, just watching. Yeah, that's... I'm very curious how you're coming up with these. I'm thinking about the things that I, I imagine that I'm gonna see when I close my eyes at night. She's kinda thick! <laughs> About to get a ghost girlfriend. I'm not into ghost girlfriends. Ghost is not my preferred monster. Oh. She's just 
disappeared. Madam. There's a thing here though. You are playing hard to get. Only good things can come from this. Also? <coughs> you hear that? Mm-hmm. You know what would be scary? What's if that? you turned around and there's someone at the top of the stairwell. Thank God that you know would be scarier. You know what would be scarier, Drew? What's that? If you turned around and somebody touched your hand. Oh, God! <laughs> you whore! This isn't funny anymore, guys. You know what would be scary? He's so good. You turned around. He was right there. You're okay. What? You're okay. You know what would be scary? What's that? If you could see a shadow of a human being cast, but no human. Moss. Eat it. I watched a documentary on the Science Channel about this incident, and they said it was a Yeti. Oh my. <laughs> they said it was aliens. I don't. What if you could see someone standing behind your mouth, but you're too afraid to put it down? I don't want to think about that. What if something casts a shadow over you, but there is nothing there? <laughs> what if the trees reached out and touched you? <laughs> and yet, I can't stop thinking about him. God, you know, the fucking tree is wrong and I don't want to be right. <laughs> All that vegetarian life. <laughs> Call that joke pending, actually. That was not funny. <laughs> what if someone somewhere was screaming for your help? And then I go in there and there's no one. I didn't and come across that. go there and there's someone. That's even scarier. Mm-hmm. What if those tall, leafless trees split apart and started walking towards you? <laughs> and they went dum da dum da dum da 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 dum Huh? God? Just like me. Oh, you think so? But you are losing your mind, my friend. Yeah. You're slipping slowly into the abyss. It's the bears. No Mm. That's so sweet. I'm in gay love with whoever's talking to <laughs> you. Wow. Looks like I might actually end up with a ghost boyfriend by the end of this. He said bottom. Just joking. <laughs> Unless. Unless. Uh. What if you succumb to the spiral? <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Unless. Oh, that is simply too much oh, words. That's... Okay. Just pretend you know what it is. In video games, when things choose you, it's just kind of like, okay. What do you. Oh. <laughs> oh, my cocky and balls. <laughs> he took it. He stole it. See me. He does. Told you. He does. No, he doesn't. He does. Oh, he most certainly does. This game would be scarier if Tall Man. <laughs> <laughs> if tall Man. If tall Man from It Follows was in it. Leave me alone. Stop. <laughs> I will game later. My 
preferred gaming experience is crouching behind a rock. Bro. He's gonna see you. <laughs> Come on! You can't get through anything, bro. That's a point on your cringe How? Character. How? Because I let you off the light. This reminds me of an episode in Criminal Minds. Yeah? How so? Um, there is a cave in it. <laughs> this reminds me of Skyrim. There's a cave in that there's, one, too. There's many caves in that one. No way. What if every single rock formation that you saw out here looked like a face? What if everything in this entire forest looked uh... like a face? Aww. Uh... Uh, <laughs> uh, 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 all right. <laughs> wow, oh my god. Uh, uh, <laughs> well, why come there are skeletons in? Oh no. Oh, oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Please, please. Oh no. Bethany has a did make this game. This is hell. You can hover now. I'm in hell. That was fun. So where's it gonna put you back on? I don't wanna know. Almost to that page, too. That one's going in your cream. Oh, huh? first. <laughs> Drew, can you put a little gold star on the screen when you're editing this? Just to know, because you did a good job. Yeah. Thank you. What if he looked inside of a cave and then it was a cave? <gasps> wow, another one of my predictions came true. I'm starting to think that I'm a little bit good at this. Is that another one out there? Yeah. Oh, that's creepy. <gasps> Wait, is that more? It look, 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 look to the left of you. Look. Oh. How did how didn't we notice this? Oh, <gasps> whoa! <laughs> that's unsettling. Damn, that's kind of cool. I, all right, all right. I'll give them props for I that. I wonder how many of these we've walked by and not even know. <laughs> did I subconsciously get that and not come up with it? No, we'll let you have Jeez. it. Okay. Uh, gold star here for Kiwi. Yeah, can you please blur out all the other skulls so that it looks like I really did come up with this? <laughs> Look, there was one right there, too. Where? There was a kind of a small one. Go back a little bit. Back, 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 back. Left. Right there? Forward. No. Where's Skull Yellows? Whatever. I'll cut Whatever. that one out. <laughs> Thank you. No, you won't. <laughs> you whore. <laughs> Kiwi cringe count. That's pretty good. I really, really like the mayonnaise type sauce that they put over it. And also the Ew. spicy mayonnaise. No, I don't like those. No, th that's... Have you ever tried it? I don't like mayo. It doesn't taste like mayo. It just tastes like good. Actually, I have tried the spicy kind. It's not bad, but I don't love it. You don't like sushi cum in your mouth, idiot? <laughs> <laughs> you know... Yeah, I do. Okay. It just got dark, bro. It's called nighttime, idiot. <laughs> I would like a scary. This is like Firewatch. Yeah, yeah. Except for yeah. you knew where you go in Firewatch. It's Firewatch, but there's. It is Firewatch because there's a fireman chasing you. And you have to. You have to. You have to. You have to, you have to, you have to watch him. 
I hope you add little ding sound effects when your cringe counter goes up. <laughs> <laughs> I haven't been here. Caution! A psychopath on the loose. A dang and romp of criminal has escaped right, from right, the right, Moscow right. mental. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so wait, is Fireman a... I don't. What? There's a lot going on here. There's ghosts, there's fireman, there's an escaped Danganronpa from the Mental Institute of Monokuma. I really hope you cut that one out. Okay. True. It wasn't funny. <laughs> 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 We're funny. We are funny. We're funny. Oh, fuck's sake. I can't remember the actual term for mankind. I keep thinking homosexual. No, that's it. Why is she British? Because she's Russian. Is that also why they said torch? Yeah, probably. No wonder the Brits would make a game this boring. <laughs> I'm- I wish I knew when it saved last. Hop in, we're going to... Spike Trap. Content! I don't know. Excuse me. Oh, Hello? I think I got this one. Hello? 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 It's me! I got all my outfit, costume stuff, and I tried it all on. Yeah. How'd it look? Um, I need to throw the robe Spill in. Spill the song, please. Sing hmm? it. Sing it. You sing it. You gotta sing it. You keep singing. Oh, oh, um, okay. Uh, no. Fuck. I need to. <laughs> I need to throw the robe in the in the in the dryer <laughs> because it's yeah I almost said that. Uh, oh. <laughs> oh, that was so scary. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, he's he's <laughs> he's in there. I reach into pocket. Wow. Fucking windows! Bang, 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 Gate. Yeah. This game is based on the Dyatlov Pass incident. Gesundheit. It was a bear. It was a bear. No wonder Drew bought this game. Leave me be. <laughs> Fucking bear in Russia. If you get killed by bear in Russia, you deserve. When you see bear in Russia, you kiss it. Give it. Take a blue. Scary man walk at you simulator. You. Boom! <laughs> what an asshole! What the fuck, seriously? <laughs> Alright, well, we're done with this one. <laughs> he came at you with a brisk jog. He always goes for your dick. He mauled <laughs> straight in.